Hi everyone, if you click this link you want to know how to set up a bank account in Xero. It's a very straightforward process and I'm going to take you through it now. So what you do is you head up to the top and you click this accounting tab. It will give a drop down and the first one you'll see is bank accounts. So if you click that, it will take you to the page which has access to all your current bank accounts. Now if you're setting up from new there will be none, um, obviously if you're adding just a new one, the ones that will be there will just be your current bank accounts. And what you want to do is you want to click add bank account. It will bring up a pop-up and from here you can search what bank account you have. So for instance, if I just search NatWest. Now once you click that, it will bring you to this stage. Now a lot of the bank accounts in Xero connect to a direct feed. Um, that's what this is, it obviously this links with Tink. So you will need to type in your account name, number and sort code, account balance and card number. This will then take you to NatWest and what will happen is it will be a direct feed. Now for the sake of the purpose, obviously I'm not going to actually add a bank account. So if I skip to the next step, this is what the screen will look like. So from here, you type in the account name, type in the account number, and you click continue. And it's that simple. Now if you were to add direct feeds to this, you would be taken to NatWest and there will be a button that says tick to connect to Xero. You click that, it would take you back to the Xero website and the direct feed will be running from day one. Cool, so it's only a short little video, but I hope this helps.